welcome back. In this video I'll be doing some work on the new power station project. This can be fitted in multiple places around the layout. It fits in multiple places around the layout. And as you can see we will in the future have a track running across here that deposits whatever it is in there. And then that's how it will work. So let's get cracking. As we can see we, I have already installed a fence on the top of that cylinder and we've got two more to install. So I'll show you how I install those fences and yeah. The first thing we need is some suitable wire and the second and probably one of the last things we need is a pair of wire cutters. What we want to do is we want to put the wire around the top, we want to lay it around the top and then cut it so that we get a section of wire that will go perfectly all the way round the edge here. And we cut our wire that will go around the edge. We need to cut about seven or slightly less, slightly more depending on how you want to do it, strips of wire that will form the supports for the fence. Cut all of the supports, just make sure they are all the same size. Once you've done that, you get your long rail that goes round and you bend these tips over and you slot them onto the rail. Once you've done that, you end up with all the posts sticking to the rail and then we can separate them and glue it down, making sure they are evenly spaced apart. I'm just waiting for a few legs to stick down and then I'll stick down the rest and then I'll come back and paint it later and I'll show you how it all goes together and I'll add the finishing touches. It's all now glued down and painted. Once it's fully dry I will do a few adjustments as it is a bit wonky compared to the one behind it. But for now it looks good, it does the job and it looks reasonably realistic. So thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing something like this on your layouts.